Hey folks, it's uh, another exciting edition. Bob Spiro, crypto pros for MLM pros. I have a very exciting show for you tonight. Uh, it's concerning a very uh, new project called PulseX. There's been a lot of uh, excitement to learn about this new uh, exchange, which will be launching on the new Pulse network which is a new fork of Ethereum. Now, I'm not a financial advisor. This is not to be taken as financial advice. You should always do your due diligence and your own research, which I'll provide you with significant uh, links and information where I do my research. And uh, this could quite possibly be the fastest project to a trillion dollar opportunity for the right people. So let's see if you agree. Uh, if you like this video, be sure to comment below and uh, share it with the waiting world. So here's some interesting facts. We have here the uh, size of different market capitalizations. Down at the bottom here, you've got Bitcoin just jumping at the bid at a trillion at 907 billion. Um, Ethereum isn't too far off. I'll show you that in a minute. Tesla at 930 billion. Um, Meta, 931 billion. Silver is 1.7 trillion. Amazon, 1.7 trillion. Saudi Aramco, um, 1.8 trillion. Alphabet, that's uh, Google, 1.9 trillion. That's pretty significant. Now, Microsoft. 2.4 trillion. Apple, 2.8 trillion. Gold, 11 trillion. You got your equities, bonds, and fixed income at just over 100 trillion each. And the largest uh, cat here is the global real estate market at 300 uh, trillion plus. By the way, this is published over on my blog. I did a little research here. Thanks uh, for sharing in the community. I have to share the uh, the credit here. Um, Apple. It took them 37 years to get to their to their first trillion. Microsoft, 33 years. And you got to love technology. Google. Uh, I skipped Amazon, 21 years. Google, 15 years. Tesla, 12 years. Facebook, nine years. Bitcoin was nine, maybe 10 years. It's getting really close. And could Pulse Chain quite possibly or Pulse X become the first trillion dollar um, market capitalized business? And here's what's going on uh, as far as that's concerned. If you don't know what Pulse is, let's take a peek at uh, who's involved in Pulse and why you should be paying attention here. Um, this is Richard Hart from the Sense Foundation. He was the uh, founder of Hex, which grew 10,000 X in less than two years, 10,000 X price in the 623rd day. And uh, he's a significant contributor and supporter of the Sens organization because what good and he became wealthy because he positioned himself in crypto back uh, way back 2011 was mining uh retired at 25 as, as you know independently wealthy and has been building uh this network that uh, we're sharing with you so pulse and this is um the uh hex that he has we stake that at uh, 38 percent so i did a uh, a recent video oh, this was just the uh, the single post showing the uh, exchanges that were launched on different platforms and how by positioning yourself in the icos or the initial um, offerings that you were invited to participate in uh, how significant the growth was in uh, market capitalization. Hex here uh, has the, the swap feature and you can also um, stake it as well. But we wanted to see what was going on with Pulse and uh, what it was here 
um, and how we participated. Well, Pulse started the sacrifice in July. And uh, I was invited to make the statement to support free speech with no expectation of profit or reward and uh, connected. This is the same process. You'll put a MetaMask wallet on your Chrome browser. And then you'll put any of your favorite coins where you connect the wallet. And then you select the network, which is the coins that you deposit to MetaMask. The link will be provided for PulseX, the exchange on Pulse. I'll explain to you why that's so significant. By year end, the sacrifice phase will begin where you get the 10,000x to one for the sacrifice. These are the different coins we used in the initial Pulse sacrifice, and any of them will be suitable for the uh, PulseX project. But let's see, take a peek here at Ethereum. You'll see the current price of Ethereum is four, a little over $4,000. Where did it go? A little over $4,000. And uh, if you had gotten in the, the well, the, the initial launch price, I guess was 30 cents, um, that represented about a 13,546 times return on your initial deposit. Now, you know, whenever you're talking about these types of projects, you have to realize they are very volatile, they are very risky, and you have the opportunity to lose all your money. So never work with money that you can't afford to lose. And uh, in my opinion, you can't afford not to participate in, in this kind of growth, but it, the secret is in participating in the correct projects that have utility, function, purpose that you can believe in that have a high expectation of future growth and a great community to support them. So this is, uh, and the interesting thing about Ethereum is there's thousands of projects that are built on the Ethereum network. Ethereum is a great network. It's a pioneer in the industry, but the problem is it's bogged down and the cost of doing business on Ethereum has become prohibitive. And we're still waiting for Ethereum 2 to come out. So Richard Hart developed Pulse as an alternative. Let's see. By participating in the PulseX sacrifice phase, the total that was sacrificed was $670 million to start Pulse. The sacrifice phase has ended and uh, there were 44,000 people that participated in the sacrifice. You find out what your um, what your uh, contribution was. I copied that to the clipboard. We put my address in here live, and we search. And uh, it was July eighteenth. I deposited 0.138 Ethereum. Then it was worth $263. I guess it's 560 or more now. Ethereum has gone up a bit, uh, but I'll be blessed with 2.63 million Pulse tokens. Now the entire concept of Pulse is they're taking the entire Ethereum blockchain and they're copying it to Pulse. So anybody that holds any ERC-20 tokens when this launches are gonna get the same token copied on the fork. So essentially what's going to happen is doubling your investment. Isn't that a pretty incredible thing? Just by taking action 
when the four captains and taking possession uh, of your new tokens. There's an interesting um, slide here I wanted to share with you. I'll see if I can locate it. That's not the one we're looking for. Ah, let's see, rip a legendary. Oh, this is exactly the slide I needed to share with you. The largest airdrop in history. So if you're owning any ERC-20 tokens on the Ethereum blockchain, you're still gonna own your original token and project. But what'll happen is when the fork happens, it'll all be brought onto the Pulse Chain network. It's faster, cheaper, quicker, easier, it has a lot of different advanced features so that the people who are using the Ethereum product, when they learn and discover they've now got a duplicate copy, will use the new product if it's cheaper, faster, easier, and better for them. Don't you agree? That will create rapid adoption with thousands of these projects and dApps that are ongoing now that will drive the price and the utility of the Pulse token through the roof. Now, here's the deal. The exchange Pulse X is going to be used to do the exchange from the Ethereum to the Pulse and vice versa. So there'll be a, a huge demand for the supply of Pulse Chain. The self-sacrificing PulseX tokens will keep driving the price and the sacrificers will get the capacity to receive a percentage of the um, sacrifice tokens that they're, that they're buying and burning. It's an ingenious program where we know and expect this to potentially become a trillion dollar business this year. And you know about it before, it's launching. And they say the pioneers do become the millionaires. It's also where the greatest risk is, but this isn't Richard's first rodeo. He's not here to make money. He's here to serve and solve problems and become known as the king of crypto. So pay attention here because it's going to happen with you or without you. Pulse chain is going to be huge. It'll have rapid adaption and the Pulse X exchange that you'll have a capacity to stake with in the, the by the end of the year. Guys, it's coming up this Friday and it'll be the same process. The first day or few days or hours, however Richard figures it out, when you sacrifice, have your coins, if you're interested, ready because it's 10,000 to one to begin and it will diminish over time till the end of the sacrifice period. And then you can't buy it until it hits the market, okay? And there'll be a limited supply. And when you understand the whole concept, um, you'll begin to get excited and you'll want to um, learn more, which you can do as uh, I'm publishing this. It'll be published here where this blog is, where I share this information. And below this, you'll have all these links right here. Where did you miss the sacrifice period for Pulse Chain during the summer of 2017? For a short time in July, you may have connected your MetaMask wallet to the Pulse Chain sacrifice address for the biggest crypto airdrop in history. Only 44,000 wallets were connected, and I shared with you mine. So, good news, you get a second chance because PulseX will be launching by year end. See, Richard did a, a live stream on Christmas and then and on Sunday and announced that Pulse X sacrifice phase starts in a few days, guys. So if any of this makes sense, if you'd like to participate, then 
Check out the information below this video. Get in touch with me. Plug in and take action because it could absolutely change your life and the lives of many other people that learn about what's going on. There's three kinds of people in the world here. The people that make things happen, the people that watch things happen, and the people that are wondering what happened. What kind of people are you? Guys, have an awesome blessed day. We'll see you again tomorrow. This is the week of lives until this program launches and we get enough excitement and education here so you can participate should you so choose to on your own due diligence. So with that in mind, that's the end of the show for tonight. We'll see you live at eight tomorrow. Bye-bye.